All these places were nowhere. Seventy have uh, joined us here for this conference. Uh, Kashmir University and I said, "Come for his remarks, Professor Paul A. Masood." That what I have been knowing, that what I have been listening since my childhood, that mankind did get fascinated by the beauty, by the symmetry of crystal somewhere in 17th century or before, even before that. To visit this place, despite all odds. Those twin states, particular molecule, the bond lengths are smaller, right? So they hold it up. Now you heat it up, or you 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 give the light, so it opens like this. I have a, a nice video to show. Uh, uh, you will get enlightened. You will get motivated. Uh, good morning, everyone. And the original idea was that we have these meetings located in. some of the smaller universities so the first meeting in the series was organized by dr kafil ahmed siddiqui in raipur is is it really too large what as they say i don't believe that history repeats itself if the people are clever history doesn't repeat itself Usually, if we are clever enough to figure out why things went wrong, then those same bad things won't happen again. Usually, in this drug cycle, what medicinal chemists were doing, you look at this sort of a scenario. See there, and then most of them said that they would love to go there, but they never visited this place. So, so I think it's an excellent decision. What has happened is. In the last 20 years, the effort to host this crystal engineering meeting, who are doing work in what may be called things that are too big to see. Now, here is a small change of technical schedule. We will have one person. So the moment you accept that name, you accept that, and so once once you have a mental fixation about names, what if it's a rubbish word? It conveys nothing. They have put this uh, molecule in the inside layer. And Dear viewers, we are at Pahalgam and three days international conference on crystal engineering begins from today. And we have with us Professor Desi Raju from uh, Indian Institute of Sciences, Bangalore. Sir, uh, tell us briefly what is the conference all about? The conference is about crystals. and how you make them in the way in which you want it will give you jobs in the pharmaceutical industry because the most important application of crystal engineering today is how to make medicines suppose the tablet is not dissolving then it can't go into the blood stream so crystal engineering teaches you how to make the tablet dissolve better so big companies are spending big money to get better medicines and this is where the main impact of crystal engineering will be felt in this the purpose of conference is to bring people from rest of country to come and talk to them because the people here in this meetings are they are all some of them world experts not india experts world experts thank you very much sir as uh, mentioned already a uh, 3 days international conference on crystal engineering began from pahalgam today and we have scientists of international reputation from all over a uh, country here they are participating in it they are discussing uh, the importance of crystal engineering what is this conference all about please tell us thank you so actually like uh, we had been planning it for quite some time but because of multiple reasons we could not have it here now as you can also appreciate the fact that kashmir is a very suitable place for such events so we can have international conferences now crystal engineering community is very small community in india so but it is growing with time and it's a new discipline definitely worldwide it is growing and it is making an impact so i think like every who and who of uh, this community in india is present here today to see how science is being done and what is happening okay. in science okay yes, so how did you find this place uh, how 
good it is for uh, organizing such conference excellent excellent actually all the speakers like uh, i think mo- all of them are coming for first time and uh, yesterday they reached here i'm sure like all of them were very excited seeing to the location only so all the tiredness they traveled all the day but once they were here they were like very fresh so like uh, this is the third conference in the series and it has the international essence in reality so but due to covid like maybe our international speakers are not here physically but we have their sessions online so uh, all the participants uh, are from iits isers and some prominent universities in india message out that uh, to the scientific community particularly definitely we have a good tourist rush in kashmir but when it comes to academics maybe we can use potential of kashmir uh, for academic uh, benefits so in that direction this is a step so that sort of like academic tourism type of thing like we think can be promoted through this event and that was the reason why we had this uh, event here in palgam instead of kashmir university man a scientists were there who spoke about uh, crystal engineering the international conference will be for two more days from today here at uh, pahalgam so we'll be bringing you more stay with us